making sure that you guys see what I'm seeing and that we're seeing the exact the exact items here is that we see again the nice turtle back. We got that nice thick comfort support. We got the nice circular uh, uh, target here. We got a good emblem. It doesn't stick out, which is nice. It, it looks like it seeps in. Uh, the quality of the leather. Um, it <laughs> What's up, everybody? It's your fair man alive the flame. What we got going on today is a special gift for you guys. But first of all, I just want to say thank you guys for coming back because you're here, I'm here, we're all here, and we all get to be together. So the cool thing that I got going on is that we got a little unboxing, which is super cool. I haven't done one of these in a while. As you guys can see here, I got fly mitts, big uh big winning mitts. I got you know all types of gloves, MK1s winnings fly and the list goes on right and some of my favorite stuff um, I like to hold on to it and I keep it stock I keep it here because I like to use it now we got something a little bit cool today we got this special doctor who's uh the owner of this brand that's called hit and move they he reached out to me and he's like hey you know a lot of coaches have deal have problems with you know, uh, golf elbow, I think they call it, or pitcher's elbow. Um, and what happens is because, you know, you have, you're holding the mitts and you're getting so many hits here, you, all the impact really goes down here to the elbows. But no worries. Apparently, these guys here take care of the situation. So let's hear, let's, say, let's stick with me. I might be opening it on the wrong side, but no big deal. Okay, so, oh, I like it. They even made a note here. It says, Coach Christian Gith. Boss will ship. Do not touch. So I don't know who was over there at home. But it says, do not touch. So first things first. Cut it nice and through. Make sure that there's nothing in the way. And guys, I'm really big on like uh, boxing. I like the fact that he has his own tape. Hit and move. That's super dope. That's real cool. Cutting this bad boy up. Let's see what we got going on, guys. Okay, a little hard, right? Okay, there we go. Is that? There we go. We're going. We're going. We're going. Okay. Got this. I just want to make sure I can open it up fully, nice, ready for you guys. And I want to see what what gifts are in here. And I want to see that. I want to express the quality that we got going on. So first and foremost, I appreciate the boxing. It's clean. It's ready to rock and roll. Do do doom. Do do doom. Check what we got going on. All right. So first things first. He sends me two mitts. Um, I could tell you I got one here I can't show you just yet and I got another one here so he has one that's uh, more therapeutic for your elbows and or actually he didn't send me two minutes he sent me one pair of mitts but it's all good I thought he sent me two anyways he sent me one pair of mitts and I think these are called the turtle mitts and these are uh, turtle mitts what happens is they have a type of padding on the side on the back side of it. So let's get going. Let's open this up right here. Wow. When you look at this type of unique mitt, it's literally, I know why they call it a turtle mitt. It's because they have this like rib, nice exposed. Look at, look at the length that it sticks out. Literally. Probably I would say like an inch. And for it being like looking like this, it doesn't feel heavy. And I'm really, if you know me, I'm really in particular with mitts. What, how do I identify a good mitt? Well, I want to make sure that it, it hugs my hand correctly. It's not a lot of loose ends. I want to make sure that there's a good pocket here on my palm. I don't want it too big because it'll make my fingers go this way. I want it to be just nice and light where I can kind of manipulate the, the mitt a little bit as more as I want. I can close and open as I please. Um, and I don't want it to be too heavy because holding for too long gets you tired. Now, I know the reason why they did this here is so that you can place in your stomach and they can throw a jab. Um, you know, instead of always running to go get the body protector, this is a good method to, to exchange. Maybe you have another handout and so on and so forth. So the, the cool thing that we see here is got a, a real nice, it's very soft padding. I'll tell you that right off the bat. It's very soft padding. Um, it's got a good circular pocket here. It's got the nice ribbed uh, turtles back here in the backside. It's got a cool design. It's all blacked out. Uh, definitely a cool color. Uh, right here, I could tell you right off the bat, it has this good little support for the bottom of the wrist. So when it, when when the fighters actually hit down low, they don't they're not 
hurting you in here um, at the bottom part of your wrist, what's going on is you have that support. So when, you know, you have, we have fighters that sometimes are not as accurate as others and they tend to hit a little low. Well, hitting them different areas that are unexpected uh, can cause a little painful situation, sometimes injury. So I appreciate this little, this little hugging uh, pocket there. So it's got a nice strap. You hear that? Look at Cool. Let's stick our hand in here and let's see what it would feel. Okay, so it's not too big and it's not too small. It fits perfect. It's got a good congestion here. I feel that. And I'm going to just close this up and I'm just going to get a feel for it overall. Now, the strap here, I see like... And, and these are honest reviews. I, I really wish that without having to try hard, I could just pull it more in. But we have a little tightness there kind of situation. That's that's also functionality, something I look at too, guys. So those little details are big for me because while you're in there in a rush, holding things down. Wow, this is a good mitt. Uh, Weight-wise, now that I'm holding and moving it around, it does seem a little bit heavier than my, than my average mitts or my regular mitts that I do hold. But these are very cushioned mitts. They're very nice mitts. The quality feels really good. And the, the, the impact that you can receive here seems really nice. Now, I, I can barely feel my hand going through here. And uh, I really don't feel anything. But uh, let me, how about we do this? Why don't we get one of the fighters in here and have them put a glove on and just hit it. And I'll tell you my feedback and see what we feel there. How's that? So hang tight. Don't go anywhere. All right, guys. I had to bring in boxing superstar Jesse, a.k.a. Super, a.k.a. The Future, a.k.a. This Is Him, a.k.a. All The Above, a.k.a. The One That Will Steal Your Girlfriend, a.k.a. <laughs> this Is the Him. This Is I Am Him. This You get the thing. All right, anyway, so he's got a good glove on right now. We're about to test trial this thing out. And I think this is, again, this is for... for for body protecting purposes, bro, don't don't knock my air out. So go really light. I just want to feel what it feels like in the backside. If you could just go a little light, little punch right there. All right, cool. Wow. Actually, I don't really feel that. Go ahead one more time. All right, one more. Wow. Hey, I'm really surprised because a lot of the, the, the mitts in the back, they have like this, uh, they don't have protection. So you feel it right on your hand. With this one, I don't feel anything. That's it pretty cool. It feels good to punch too. Really? Yeah. All right. All right, let's try this. Let's try this right here. Let's get a little hook going. Now you hit hard no matter what. Wow, this feels really nice. Let's see, double it up. Wow, great. I mean, this kid's soft. This kid hits hard. So like, even <laughs> when I use mitts, if I was to do mitts with him, I'm taping up. I'm using the whole thing. But guys, I mean, this feels nice. I'll give you guys more info, Jesse. Thank and you so much. And it feels nice bro. too on the front end. Yeah. What do you think about the? What do you think about this? I mean, we got Jesse here now, so might as well use him. What do you think about mm. these mitts? I just got them delivered. Um, so they're supposed to be this, these therapeutic uh, mitts, um, mm -hmm. and they're also functional because of the, uh, they call this the turtle backs. Uh, apparently they help, so when, you know, instead of, you know, putting your hand down there and you hitting a punch, mm -hmm. the cool thing that you could use is you could put them as a, as like, kind of like a pocket holder here so you can hit down to the body. What do you think about its overall look? I mean, it's very distinct, very different. I think uh, people will kind of look at it twice before buying it. Yeah, no, it looks really nice. Um... No, it just it feels really good, especially when you hit it too. It's like a it's like a heavy double end. It feels like okay. It feels cool. like a heavy double end. Now I know I know there's different types of mitts that I use. There's mitts that I like to use with certain fighters because they get more motivated when they hit it, when they hear that pop, when they hear that noise, they mm -hmm. get more excited. Now, do you think this is something that would probably encourage you to hit more? Is it something that's in the middle, maybe not more or less, or mm -hmm. what do you think? Yeah, especially uh, my dad, my coach, he likes. Uh, Loud mitts, especially uh, something like this. Yeah. So something like this. All right, guys. So yeah. you heard it from from Super right here, Superstar. All right. So real quick, I want to just get a real close up here. I want to make sure that you guys see what I'm seeing and that we're seeing the exact the exact items here. Is that we see again the nice turtle back. We got that nice thick comfort support. We got the nice circular uh, uh, target here. We got a good emblem. It doesn't stick out, which is nice. It, it looks like it seeps in. Uh, the quality of the leather 
Um, it seems a little bit more on that glossy, glossy side. Um, I'm more of a guy that likes more of the flat tone. I'm not trying to compare ne necessarily to fly or anything, but I do like this flat feel. I feel like when sweat gets on it, it doesn't get as slippery. So I'm, I'm excited to see how that works. I do like the interior in here. It's not soft, so I know my hands are not going to slip. Here has got that nice durable thing where I can carve it in. Um, so my pros for sure are that the padding's there and that if it's what I'm looking for a padded mitt, this would be it. Now, concerns of mine, um, things that I have here, for example, this metal, this metal uh, clip here, I'm more of a fan that maybe it's not made out of metal. Maybe it's made out of plastic. I know maybe for durability practices, but you know, again, I'm not really a fan of the metal clipping. Um, also, when I pull, I feel like the strap, I feel like it gets stuck. There's like this little uh, carve here, this line. Um, I'm just being as honest as possible. Another thing that I'm trying to look at here, see maybe things that I probably wouldn't like. Other than that, I'm a guy that likes a lot of colors, so maybe something with a lot more color into it. But overall, I see it working well. Again, it's just maybe the strap that I would per uh, perfect and the type of leather, I would like it more of a soft where it's, where if you slide your hand down, it doesn't fly through. I like it more, a uh, little bit more rough through that feel. But other than that, you know, I just wanna say most importantly, like thank you for sending me this. Guys, find them, the, these, these mitts are called Hit and Move Turtle, and you can uh, follow them on Instagram at Hit and Move. They got boxing glove, a lot of the stuff is very therapeutic. They're made by a doctor, which is super cool. And um, other than that, I mean, let them know where they can find you, bro. Uh, Jesse Mandapat on Instagram, just J E S S I E M A N D A P A T. So I got to do a full video with Jesse. Jesse's got a cool background growing up. He definitely grew up, you know, from a from a kind of like a rough area, and then coming on as a fighter all his life. I mean, it's all all he knows how to do is just fight. So you know, seeing him in the gym, seeing him work, and on his road to becoming hopefully a world champion one day in his life is super cool. I mean, I've known him since he was a kid. He used to have abs. He was the only kid that had abs, I think, ever in history in the world. <laughs> anyway, this guy was probably born with abs. I don't know how, what his dad ate or <laughs> what his mom was probably doing abs when he was in the belly. I have no idea. But this kid has abs since I can remember. Um, other than that, guys, yeah, check these out. See what you guys think. I'm going to try them out a little bit more and see what they feel like. Uh, the only things, the pros and cons, the positive things I could say about these things is I love the padding. If you're looking for padding, these are for you. If you're looking for something smaller where you're trying to work more on speed and stuff, maybe you might want to try something a little bit smaller. Other than that, though, these are safe, and I love safety. I mean, if you put safety first, go and grab it. Make sure you guys tune in to our flame www.flameboxing for all the official merch of the flame and Wrap get it. And I know make sure you go down, down in the comments, you comment, make sure you like, make sure please, pretty, 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 please subscribe. And that's it. That's all I could tell you guys. You know what? I love you guys if you're going through it. The flame's with you. La vida es para hoy, no mañana. Tres leches, baby. Ow!